Hello guys, how we doing? I know it's been a while. I haven't posted a video in a little while and you're probably expecting my next video to be either my first deal in Dubai or I left Dubai. I know 50% of you were expecting one, 50% of you were expecting the other guys. I have a check in my hand right now and I have my first deal done. It's been a good and interesting process to get here. A lot of things almost went through and didn't go through, um, but we finally got there. You know what? It might have felt difficult out here, but I can see that it's not difficult out here. It's just a long process, but I do realize that I was doing the right things. And my, my sweetheart's doing this right now. It's been tough, it's been stress, probably a lot of stress that there was no point being under because if I was not in that mood, it wouldn't have changed anything anyway. But here we are, uh, first deal done. First time I met this guy who I got the deal for was actually probably over a month ago. But um, I really put the effort in for him. I'd say I'm very friendly with him. Like uh, we respect each other a lot. And because of that, I went the extra mile to get him the apartment he was looking for. Thanks for your support, the love, the hate, I don't mind. It's all part of the story. I gotta thank everybody for the comments, for the encouragement, for checking in on me to see if I was all right. I was always all right, even if I was stressed. I gotta say thank you to my girlfriend. Thank you to my girlfriend. <laughs> it's just a little sweetheart and she really takes care of me. She's cooking for me right now. I don't have to cook meals when I'm out here. I haven't washed a shirt or ironed a shirt in quite some time. How relationships work best, to be honest. My, my girlfriend is someone I wasn't expecting to meet, but when I met her in the last year, um, it's changed my life. <laughs> what? Want to hug and finish? Yeah. This is not enough for me to go wild and celebrate and splurge money. But it's definitely a start and it's well needed because I'm no longer the guy without a deal. Guys, um, you can achieve anything if you put your mind to it. This is still nothing on the grand scheme of things. And it's time to get going, moving on to uh, what's, what's to happen next. Thank you for watching. See you in the next video. More regular from now on. Take care. Hi guys, welcome back to the channel. Today is Monday, the 27th of March. Um, I came out to Dubai with a loan from HSBC Bank um, in order to come here, smash it, and make as much money as possible. Now, I've been working super hard, and I haven't gave myself credit because I have been doing the right things. But so far, I haven't established myself in Dubai and I haven't made any money. Now, this is not a down in the dumps intro to the video, but... How much money have I got left? How much time have I got left? That's the real question people will be thinking. And it's not long. These next seven days, I need to make something happen. And I need to make some money. There's another YouTuber there, I think. With a guy. Right now, I feel a little bit defeated. As, um, I don't know, just a tough morning. I had a deal going through and then uh, it got cancelled last minute. It's just disappointing really. But yeah, feeling a bit down on a Monday morning, but that doesn't mean I can't feel completely ready for raring to go at 3 p.m. I found a lot of times it's been like that. I've been maybe down in the dumps at one point, but then by the end of the day, I'm, I'm in a whole different energy, but that kind of deflated me this morning. To meet the missus for lunch. By the way, my camera's gone missing uh, from my hotel room. I think I'm looking into that, but uh, I'm using my iPhone now to go home and eat lunch with. You know, the reason I do all this and the reason I'm out here fighting. Hello, <laughs> you okay? I'm filming on my iPhone for once. <laughs> oh, you made me some lunch. Have you made you some lunch? No. no. 
When are you gonna have? I'm going to eat it. Baby. <sighs> nice. Thank you, my dear. Right, I need to up the ante, I need to up the energy. I feel a little bit defeated and a little bit hmm, deflated. And like I've lost my voice a little bit and that's not good. That's what, it's not what I need going forward this week. As this week is probably make or break for me. I'm highly capable, there's nothing no one else in my company is doing that I can't. I will figure this out. About to head off to work. Um, I'm trying to buzz myself up guys, I, I will get there. The thing is, this week's make or break for me and right now the energy I'm putting out into the universe is, is break. So, regardless of how this week turns out, I don't want to say I went down without a fight. Friends, one of my favorite buildings on the marina, 23 Marina. One out of two of you and some for today. That first one went really well because they're not moving till June, but the thing is, check this out. They're not moving till June, but the thing is, they want to put a deposit down now and they want to put it down on a, a place where price ain't the price is out of the question. Right, out for my second view of the day now. Ocean Heights, um, two bedroom. Hey, so um, I've just been working on this right now. Getting it true checked, like getting photos taken. But supposedly they've just received a, um, a deposit for this and this one's just rented out. Unfortunately, so I won't be working on it any longer. Uh. But I went for a viewing downstairs just before and it went well, but the guy doesn't want to make a final decision right now and that's something as an agent that is told you need to do, you need to push for every single time you go for a viewing. And, and look, I did, but that's the thing with, with dealing with properties in this particular price range is there's just a lot of there's more time wasting. I actually feel like maybe it might be harder to get them properties, but it's better to go for the more expensive properties. Because that way you do viewings and people are actually looking to move in. Yeah. But yeah, regardless of whether this is now rented out, I should probably leave. <laughs> regardless of whether this one's now rented out. Within the next three days, I could get free deals coming in. Um, and at the same time, they could all fall apart. And yes, it's based on my performance, I get it. But there's also a level of control I don't have. And uh, yeah, it's a, it's a very doggy dog world out here. And that's what I'm prepared for. I know a few people who watch my YouTube channel don't think I'm capable of that doggy dog energy and see me as some kind of vulnerable boy. But to be honest, I've been through a lot of stuff in my life and um, I'm not as naive as I may come across to some people. Yeah. I'm out here in Dubai. I don't know how it's gonna go out here. It's, it's sure getting to the point where I need to get someone over the line, but I know my capabilities and I know my capabilities uh, are to the highest level. Um, guys, thanks for watching. All right, guys. I'm gonna show you how much it is to fill a tank here in Dubai. I think usually around 100, 120, 80D, depending on the place. Really affordable. Nothing else here is affordable, but the petrol is really affordable. Where are you from? Uganda. Oh, Uganda, nice. Okay, thank you. All good? See you in a bit, my friend. What's your name? Vincent. Vincent. Yeah. Have a good day, Vincent. We're on the back end of Tuesday and uh, just completing my second day. 
I got recommended a barber. I messaged that barber. He sent me a location. I saw a barber shop. I walked in and it was a different barber shop, different guy. But I wasn't gonna tell him. Oh no, I don't want to cut my cut here. He did an okay job. Did my beard as well. I look a bit funny with the mustache. I can't lie. But yeah, day two. Feeling five out of ten. You know, a bit tough, but today I made a, a video for the off plan. Hopefully, I find someone. Hi guys, we're outside Signature Livings, which is the previous project of the Green Group. Hello guys, how you doing? It's now Wednesday. This is the day I want to make something happen. I have final viewing in Elite Residence, the building's called. And uh, you're seeing two of me, and I think that probably because another agent wouldn't work with me, I think they're going to see one with someone else. It'd be nice just to, just to get my first deal and get the ball rolling. Um, but I never know what's, I don't know what's gonna happen. A little bit, a little bit stress right now. Uh, nah, it's cool, I'm in a jacuzzi, bro, I'm fine. Um, but I'm about to hop out and get ready. Go smash it, I've got photos to take of another place as well. I'm not gonna feel sorry for myself, bro. This is a valuable experience, no matter what happens. That's the way I got to see it on like a long time scale. At 25 years old, I'm going to look back at this no matter what and be, be happy that I did it. So the deal I'm trying to close today is in this one here. The tall one there. Um, decent prices in there. Prices have just dropped. I don't know if it's because it's Ramadan or prices were too high anyway. Prices were too high at the moment um, recently. But I mean, people are still moving in. There's just a lot of negotiation involved. This is the building I'm trying to, in the back, I'm trying to close on today. Let's go, let's get it done. Come on. So. I'm here in one of the apartments I'm showing early. The Diwaza, which is the Dubai electricity and water. Basically, when, you, you, when you're a tenant, you pay like a fee to that to get your electricity and water on. And obviously, as this isn't tenanted, that's the case right now. So this is a very nice and simple one bedroom. Nice open kitchen space. And then through to the bedroom. Both of the apartments I've shown could be on the cards for today. It's just, you know, you met another agent as I was, was leaving. He's uh, moving in today. I don't want the other agent getting in there. I actually rung this agent yesterday, trying to, you know, submit permission. That's how we do it out here with this agent. But he wasn't in. I could really do with this deal going through. Yeah, it's fine. Like. And this is a renovated apartment. I'll be uh, I'll be leasing in. Well, the guy told me it was going to be available today. Obviously, somebody's told him different. I don't know if he's out of country. I think he actually might be. Uh, but yeah, this is getting renovated, as you can see. <clears throat> The lights are actually majority under the floorboard. Wait. Check them lights. They're boss. But uh, let's get all these lights off. Oh, that's boss. This is going to be a special apartment, man. Overlooking the Burj Al Arab as well, which is one of my favorite buildings in Dubai. I'd say I like the Burj Al Arab. I like. I like Kayan Tower just to look at because it's kind of cool. 
and I also like there's this one in JLT is it called the dome that's a, just a really nice building to look at there's another one I don't know the name of but like twin towers um, but yeah good news guys so the view out of all the ones out of all the ones that guy viewed he preferred one overlooking the beachfront over there and um, he's gonna come back later with his brother where I'll hopefully close my deal let me see right round two let's get this shit closed right round two let's get this closed it's 5 30 let's do this Right, that went well, but I didn't get it signed, so keep on going, bro. Um, he, I think he wants it, but he's just playing the game. It's it's all negotiation at that point, and no one's giving too much away. Uh, I, I, I'm i good with the client, though, so I met him, like, numerous times, three or four times now. Um, I'm going to figure it out. <laughs> but, yeah. More good news, on my way back, I got a call asking for another viewing. They wanted to go tonight. I know people will be listening to that thinking, why didn't you go? But the weekend would be better for me because I can send them more options and we can go around and I've told them anything he likes, send me it through, just work with myself. Um, man. Let's let's move, let's keep on going. Right now I'm going back into office. There'll only be a handful of people still in there probably. Um I'm gonna WhatsApp spam landlords. That's kind of the process, but most people prefer calling. Well not prefer but you know, calling's more difficult, challenging, and probably more of a character builder. You can WhatsApp people so much faster. I'm gonna WhatsApp blast people. And then when I get an answer, I'll call them. A happier, fuller, and richer life. So begin to use these miracle working affirmations and smooth your way in daily affairs, solve business problems, and bring harmony in family relationships. Begin your. <laughs> First deal is going through today, fingers crossed. I would say I deserve more than what I've got out of it. And thing is, I'm going to make this company a lot of money because I've picked up a lot of stock, but it's just stock towards the end of the year. Eventually, I'll, I'll figure something out and I'll be a real success. This is just part of my journey. This is a very difficult part of my journey. I almost had an off plan deal that, that would have made me like 15 grand UK. It just fell through, it didn't work. And it's painful, man. It's painful. And I don't feel myself anymore. Hello guys, welcome back to the channel. Today is the day it's happening. I've had my first deal agreed. Um, it's not a massive one, but it's good to get my first one over the line, just to give me that energy and that momentum to go forward. 
Um, it took a lot of stress, it took a lot of effort, but now we're here and we're growing in this industry. And uh, I've been a bit harsh on myself, as you guys know. Honestly, I have been doing the right things a lot. And finally, we're getting sun over the line. But today, with no data, I've run out. I don't know how, it's because that I do know how. My Wi-Fi connected. My Wi-Fi didn't connect in the hotel last few nights. And it was eating data, I guess. So now I'm going to go into the marina. I'm going to do another viewing and I'm going to sort out my first deal today. Come on. So this is where I'm going to view now. You see, not this one, but the one behind it. The one that goes up, up here. That's the one I got my first deal in. I'm getting the checks today. This one right here, that's the most expensive on the marina to rent. And uh, I'm going for a purview. Right, the viewing. It didn't go amazing, but I'm just gonna keep on looking for this guy because I'll find what he I'll find something that he's looking for. I just haven't got anything right now. I actually bumped into one of the lads who was uh, at Amazon with me. I was like, what the I said to him, oh hello, full of surprises, Dubai isn't it? He's he starting real estate on Monday. Opportunity out here, I, I get why people do it, you know? But it's a risky game, it's a, it's a risky game. So many people come out here and they could work for three months and end up leaving and going home. But the thing is for these real estate companies, the three months they were there, yeah, they might have not made any money then. But they've went and put loads on the particular real estate company's uh, database. They've went and found loads of options for the company later on in the year. And then the real estate agent, uh, but the real estate agency will reap the rewards for that. The thing is, by this time, the agents come back home because they've run out of money. So it's a, it's a tough game, bro. And uh, if you're coming out here like I did, just understand the risk you're taking. Um, it's me who took this risk and it's not any, you know, any companies. Best buildings, Kion Tower, Marina Gate. These are the sickest. At night, bro, they have these, these are yellow lit up skin squares. I'll show a picture. It's a proper sick place, man. But yeah, man, like I said, onwards we go. And uh, you could even look for salary positions out here, to be honest, guys, if you, there are some places you can get real estate salaries. Right, just going up now to change the contract because the con there were some disagreements in the contract between my, my client and the landlord. But now everyone's agreed I'm going into work to change it. Then I'm gonna go and get the checks. Right, finally getting this closed today, I'm on my way um, to get the deposit, etc. Uh, last night I couldn't sort it out because they needed changes in the contract and I didn't get the updated contract. Now I have. We're gonna get everything signed. Oh my, I'm shattered. But you know what, good thing is guys, um, I'm not gonna be the guy with, without a deal yet. It's not a big deal, but it's a deal. And like, yeah. Yeah. 
now my I change my visa and uh, I start my this work. Good man. I used to go pro too, but right now I only got my phone with me. It's a very good result. I've got the same one, yeah. Pro level. It's good. Yeah, it's, it's good. very nice. Yeah. So I just bumped into my friend and he was shooting a video. Yeah. Go and shout out your channel. My channel name is Zulkar Vlogs. It's Z-U-L-Q-A-R-V-O-L-O-G. Are you from Pakistan? Yeah, I'm from Pakistan. Zindabad. Thank you, about. thank you. What city? Uh, what's your... Uh... My channel is uh, Zach Jones. And you come here for uh, working before I am six years in uh, Dubai. Okay, yeah. I'm doing an interior job. Oh, yeah, great. Then no time for a uh, tourist visit. Ooh. <laughs> yeah, no, I... Then you not go for an outing. All yeah. time work, yeah, work, yeah, work. We have busy. only Sunday holiday, then sleeping. Opportunity, you know. Yeah. Uh, I do real estate. Okay. On YouTube. Yeah. Oh. It's good. It's good. It's good. I start from Dubai. Now, after uh, all Dubai cover, then I go Abu Dhabi. Okay. Then Alain. Then yeah. Fujira, all How long have you been? Seven Emirates I cover. How long have you been on YouTube? I am Me? on YouTube in 2016, but I am oh. not doing uh, uploading videos on YouTube my, on my channel. Yes, but you I start just now. In, uh, last month. Yeah. How many subscribers? Uh, 6.5k. Come oh on, that's <laughs> fast. That's fast. Uh, yesterday I applied for the monetization. Oh really? Yeah. Good. Yeah. Come on. <laughs> yeah. We'll get you. We'll get you. We can do enough. this like full full time. Full time. Job. It's not far off, bro. It's six. It's six k. It's honestly. Has your growth been recently? Yeah. Like, have you recently grown, or have you grown over time? Over time. Yeah. So. Because uh, before I am making like uh, electrical videos, how to do electric work. Yeah. Then after I changed uh, in in tours and visiting all the place. Fantastic. Well, we'll have to get together again. Uh, I've got your Instagram Phil. I mean, your YouTube is Phil Tor. Okay, I search yours. Zach, Z-A-C. Z-A-C. Z-A. Z. -A -C. Z, -A -C. Z, -A. Z. 15.3K. Yes. Well, we'll, we'll get together again and do a video. Oh, you have uh, 293 videos. Yeah. I upload uh, 150 videos. Wow, my friend. Okay. Pleasure. Nice to meet you. Inshallah, yep. we meet again. Yeah, inshallah. Yes, for sure, my friend. Right. Right. Um. Right, guys. Deal signed. It's been a long journey to get more consistency. Probably deal over the line. I'm not going to celebrate. I'm not going to celebrate in Dubai because it wasn't that big of a deal. But what I'm going to do is I'm going to drive out the sea and see some of the nature, which is something I think I'm